a hot cup of coffee. But this morning, some folks in Traveler's Rest had a little company. Ted Faton has a look as folks enjoyed Coffee with the Cop. It's an opportunity to see past the uniform and connect with the person behind it. Folks in the community enjoyed a cup of joe this morning with the men and women in blue for Coffee with a Cop. It's something Traveler's Rest Police Chief Ben Ford says is especially important for everyone involved. We want the community to know that we're transparent, we're open, we're, we're open to tell them whatever they want to know about our department. We want them to feel safe in this community. We want them to have a happy lifestyle here. And, and, and we just want to work with them to make this the best community there is in, in all of South Carolina. Ford tries to hold one every other month or so, hoping to help build a relationship between the officers and the community that they serve. Folks that came out really enjoyed getting to know the people that work in their neighborhood each and every day. I think there's always a little bit of maybe, maybe not distrust, but maybe a little like if a cop is around then that something is wrong and, and maybe they're looking at me and all those kind of things. So this is a way of us like finding out whether we feel comfortable with the people that are serving us here. So that's important. Coffee with a Cop moves from coffee shop to coffee shop each time, making sure to give everyone in the community the chance to come out and build the relationships. In Traveler's Rest, Ted Faton, Fox Carolina News. If you missed this morning's Coffee with a Cop, you can follow Traveler's Rest Police Department's Facebook page to find out when there will be another one.